hi everyone welcome back again on my channel if you're just seeing my face hey eh, my name is Mukola, and welcome on my channel and for you to have a pass to be a family member on this channel you know what you have to do now just it's very very simple and free just smash the subscribe button and turn your bell notification on in today's video guys i am going to be revealing a lotion to you guys which has been in the market for quite a while but yeah my this is my own morning and this is when i want to do a review about it this is when i'm able to gather some reasonable reviews and just deliver to you guys honestly i have never used this product on my skin but from you guys and from my research from sellers um, point of view and as well from some people who have used it i am here to deliver something to you guys which is a review of this product give you guys some tips and just talk about the ingredients and what you should expect while using this product and how you should use it because these are commonly made mistakes when it comes to lotions like this according to the silka papaya lotion it says uh, it is written on the body that is going to whiten your skin in seven days which this should ring a bell in your head that seven days your skin is going to be whitened i don't know their own definition of whitening because there are some vaseline lotion that it is written as a whitening cream and it does not do anything close to whitening on the skin so i don't want to judge by that but regardless if it is written like seven days that means that they have been specific that in seven days you should very you should see a very clear changes according to this lotion as well it can help with dark spots it can help with dark knuckles and the user doesn't give dark knuckles as well i hope with hyper pigmentation on your skin and on the ingredients it has so many interesting ingredients in it that it has a moisturizing ingredient it has calming ingredients and there are some few um key ingredients in it as well the likes of niacinamide the likes of salicylic acid the likes of sodium edta and you know it's a papaya um lotion then definitely it has to contain a key ingredient which is the papaya extract papaya extract is amazing to tone your skin to help with hyperpigmentation to help you with the uneven tone you have on your skin it is going to help you papaya extract is amazing you can see videos of papaya wash all over youtube it's just because of how amazing this particular ingredient is on the skin it has the ability to lighten up your skin on a long usage and if you are using it very safe if you make it by yourself and you can sweat it that there is no extra chemical added to it this is something that can be used for a long period of time this particular lotion it is written on it that is going to whiten your skin in seven days and i just want to say this cream actually delivers i'm going to explain to you guys if you have a very tough skin if you have a tough skin this product can actually work on your skin so that means if you have a sensitive skin you have to be very very careful if at all you want to move closer to the skin it actually does lighten the skin it does lighten the skin and you have to be very very careful with this lotion and again it has an spf of six which makes it super amazing because a lot of lightning products that you will see out there in the market they don't they don't have spf and don't say because there's an spf of six in this particular lotion then it is enough to protect your skin no especially if you are fighting hyperpigmentation and you want to use a lotion like this no matter how tough your skin is i would still advise you to get a to get an spf that's probably cheap but still effective there are some that you get in a nearby drugstore all those ones that you can feel will break out on your face you can actually switch to them and use them on your body to help you hasten up clearing up your hyperpigmentation on evil skin tone on your skin spf is always recommended i know till date i still get questions on what an spf is please you can read it up what an spf is i just want to put this in that spf is not only for your face it can be used all over your body except the place that they are holes please don't use it deal but it can definitely be used all over your body spf is very very good for the body as well especially people who are trying to fade hyperpigmentation and, and fighting on even skin tone so the spf in this lotion is not enough to protect your skin you still need to get more one thing about this lotion as well is that it is going to help you smoothen your skin Papaya, I already talked about the fact that papaya helps with uneven skin tone and that is actually what this cream does. It will smoothen your skin and it is so effective, especially on skin that are tough. That's because the cream is strong and that's why if you have a sensitive skin, you need to be careful. If you have a sensitive skin and you have a coconut head and you want to use it, probably use it four times a week. You know one thing is, when you are using products like this, strong product like this that it will tell you whiten and blah blah blah, 
let me tell you it can dry out your skin in order for you to have the best of skin you still have to incorporate using a moisturizer with it or a body butter or a body oil in fact for this i'm going to advise you to get a moisturizer with it or a body oil with it this is going to help you a lot so if you're just introducing your skin to it and you have a tough skin product actually work on your skin then you can use it for maybe five six days a week and just have a rest day but if you know you have a sensitive skin you can use it three to four times to help correct your skin and use moisturizers and very good body oils in between the shea oil that i actually talk about in my last two videos are amazing the avino shea oil is so amazing to help even out your skin tone so i would advise you guys that you should get a moisturizer and as well probably a body oil with it any of the two or both actually can work with this particular lotion so people who have tough skin can use it in more days the reason why i'm saying this is because products like this is going to get to a point that you'll not be able to use it so if that is the only thing you're introducing your skin to by the time you actually want to relax it might probably take you to square one and it should not make sense like all these months of you trying to clear your hyperpigmentation is basically gone and you won't like that so that's why i always advise people if there isn't any product like this i know as nigerians as africans one thing we fight a lot is hyperpigmentation you can't deny that and people are always on the run to get product that is going to help them with their hyperpigmentation but on the other hand you still need to stay safe please guys stay very safe if you is going to if you have the time you can google some of this um, ingredient that you will see go on your search bar and just search for the ingredient in silka papaya lotion if you can read more about it read more about it i know you guys already know about niacinamide um salicylic acid sodium edta papaya extract that's why i actually mentioned that because i know you guys are going to have an idea about that one thing again that i want to point out in this lotion is please if you're just trying it out there is no point for you to mix it with anything please don't ask me what can you mix with this lotion because i know the probability of me getting this question you do not need to mix anything with this lotion go in and use it like that don't mix anything with it it is strong enough to deliver a very good job for you and according to soap that you can use about it i actually want to make a different um video about the soap the silka papaya soap it is such an amazing soap that can be used um to make all these people making 3d soap all this mulatto soap if people actually do add it to their black soap as well to help lighten in case they cannot get papaya extract or they cannot make papaya extract this is one soap that people actually great with their black soap to make a very good lightening black soap so the soap as well is amazing the soap actually brightens the skin the soap works almost hand in hand with extract and i think i'm still going to talk about the soap and extract together in another video but one soap you can actually use with this product is the soap so the soap is very very amazing you can get it with it and this is why i say the soap is okay effective this cream is okay effective that is why you need the moisturizer so that you don't dry out your skin too much if you have used this product before please let us know in the comment section we are there reading your comments and replying and chatting okay before you go guys do me a favor smash the subscribe button and turn your bell notification on and i'll definitely see you guys in my next video bye guys